Hello, today I'm going to do my first video on different ways to change from window to window. So as you can see, I have my different windows open. I have Google, my screen capture software, notepad, PowerPoint, and Word. <coughs> so I'm going to show you how to change from window to window to get there in a funky way. So there's the normal way which everyone does. They go like that, 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 and then they... But you have to minimise all that, and then it gets a bit boring after a while. So, it's always a bit nice to have a bit of fun when you're at the computer. So the first thing we're going to do is start and tab. So you're going to press those buttons at the same time on your keyboard. And a display like this should come up. And you can change by releasing your hand finger from the tab button and clicking it to change. So there's my screen capture software, PowerPoint, Google, Notepad, my desktop, and then you can change all through it. So say, if I'm on my desktop, so if I want to get to, say, my um, power internet, so I just click there, internet. So whichever one is in the front of the screen, that's my word. That's my word there. And also, to go backwards, if you press the shift button as well, you go backwards when you do this. So if, you, if you're going start tab, and you want your desktop to be excellent, you go past it, just click shift and go back, back into the desktop. That's the first way. And the other way to do it now is alt and tab. You press alt and tab at the same time, and then as you press it, release your finger from the tab button. So then you get this display, and then you can flick from, there's my notepad, internet, desktop, and then you can also click. And if you hold shift, you go backwards as well. So there. Those are the different ways to change from window to window on Windows 7. Thank you very much for watching.